way. Uh, but yeah, Boys of Somerville, um, really great film. I uh, got to see a movie called Barstool Cowboy. Oh, yeah. You can check out the trailer for that on YouTube, actually. And, you know, yeah, that one got picked up for distribution, too. Yeah. Actually, out of the ten films that we screened last year of the uh, official selections, five of them got picked up for distribution. Yeah. yeah. So I think that attributes uh, to... Uh, they were doing something good for the filmmaker by getting yeah. their name out there, getting this film, getting their films yeah. out there. And it's not just for for you know, film you know, screen fest. It, it's it's for it's for anybody. Yes, it's for anybody that loves movies. But it's also if you are an, an actor or a filmmaker, mm -hmm. it's for it's it's a place for people to network. I remember yeah, a definitely. few writers brought in some uh, some of their uh, their um, uh, what's scripts. The scripts. <laughs> yes, their scripts last year. We had a table read and it was it just was really cool. Fun. It was a Q and A with uh, directors like answers, Brooks yeah. Benjamin and whatnot. Um, well, that's basically been. what that is. Is after the <laughs> uh, after the films, the the directors and the actors will come up and give the audience a chance to ask them questions about yeah. their film. Yeah. So really cool. So anyway, let's talk about. I mean, what can we expect this year? I know a buddy of mine, Mitch Moore, who you might recognize from the backstage. Sabrina Fair videos. He was in Sabrina Fair with me. He did a film called Seed of Doubt, and mm -hmm. uh, I had the opportunity to see that a little while back. And it, it was it was a short film, and it was really really good. It was a really great film. You can see that this year yeah. at Screen Fest. What what can we expect this year? Tell uh, us what. Basically, to what, what we're looking at is March 26th through 28th. Uh, we'll be starting with uh, opening night party. I believe around six o'clock at River Terrace at the Doug Widener Lounge. Uh, this year we're going to try to keep everything pretty much centrally located at River Terrace. Uh, directly after the party we go into screenings. Um, starting the next morning, I believe around 10 o'clock, we're doing free screenings, which is something new for us this year, because mm -hmm. we're actually doing free screenings of the winners from last year. Uh, and then what we'll be doing is we'll be accepting donations for the American Red Cross during those screenings. And those yeah. will last probably about two hours long, a little over two hours. Uh, then you go into uh, the afternoon screenings. Uh, and then we'll take a brief intermission around 5, 5.30, and uh, Janelle Walker from uh, Talent Track Agency will be coming out oh, yeah. to do um, sort of a uh, question-answer session and a workshop on uh, using an agency in this region and the importance of having an agency if you're going to be in the business. Mm -hmm. uh, so we're really excited about that. Then, we'll go, then after that, uh, we'll go into some more screenings. Sunday morning, we'll finish up the screenings, and then uh, that evening, we'll do a, an award ceremony to announce all the winners of the festival. And we've got, this year, we've got a first a grand, pro, grand prize, second prize, third prize, an audience viewer's choice mm -hmm. award that we're giving out. Um, and then also, we're doing best actor, best supporting actor, best act actress, and best supporting actress. So awesome. we're really excited about you know trying to get everyone involved and getting everybody came out to watch these amazing films. So essentially, Screen Fest is a jam-packed movie event. I mean, there are tons, there's tons of stuff going on. You know, if you love movies, if you're interested in how filmmaking, if, you, if you're just interested in the process, you know, it, it's a learning experience. There's also food, right? We oh, had food yeah. there we'll, last we'll year. We'll have a little food. We'll, we'll have little concessions. Snacks and good concessions. Little popcorn and soda yeah. and stuff. Yeah. Um, the other thing too is you know, we've got, um, if you want to purchase tickets, you yeah, can get tickets. them Talks at uh, www.screenfest.eventspot.com. Uh, you can also get them from the website that will direct you there, uh, gatlinburgscreenfest.com. Uh, we've got tickets for sale. We've got um, a great package right now called Film Fanatic Package. Mm -hmm. And basically what that is is you pay $25.00. And you get to see every screening uh, throughout the festival, and also you'll be able to attend the awards banquet. We try to make it very affordable for people to come out because we want people to come out and watch these films. Yeah. And then uh, in that, if you purchase an individual ticket, you're not seeing just one movie. Yeah, we've we've put them into lots, what we call lots, and usually you get to see two or three films. Yeah. So for five dollars, you can see two or three films, and you just can't beat that. It can't I mean, beat it at all. And, and like I said, our objective is to. Uh, Get people to come out and just watch these amazing films and yeah. support independent film. It's great storytelling on film. These are the new T-shirts, right? Oh yeah, this, this is you can purchase on the website. Right? It's the official Film Fanatic uh, 2010 Gatlinburg Screen Fest Film Festival. Really mm -hmm. excited about those. Yeah. Uh, Ten dollars. You know, you can't beat that for a T-shirt. Um, and then, uh, like I said, we're just excited about everything that's going on this year. Yeah. Well, I know I'm really looking forward to being there and checking it out. Um, and for all of you movie makers out there, get your cameras rolling to submit for next year. Yeah. 
Um, I know I've got a few ideas I'm kicking around in my head. I may try to oh, see really? for well, next year. So see. I don't know. You know, we'll okay. we'll see. Um, so there's the website. Mm -hmm. You have a Facebook page. We do have a Facebook page. for the bookers. Uh, also on the Facebook page too, where uh, if you go into our group, which is Screen Fest Film Festival, you can start seeing these trailers for the films that we're going to be screening. So you can kind of get a, get an idea of what films you might want to see by looking at the trailers mm -hmm. through our Facebook group. Yeah, and we've got a MySpace site. MySpace for the spacers. Yeah, MySpace for the spacers. Yeah. <laughs> so, but no Twitter for the tweeters. No Twitter. Uh, unfortunately, <laughs> uh, I don't think we're quite to the Twitter yeah. stage yet. <laughs> well, um, my cell phone's going off right now. Oh, that's and, okay. <laughs> yeah. But anyway, so yeah, uh, Gatlinburg Street Fest. What are the dates again? It's uh, <clears throat> March 26th through 28th. Last weekend in March, Last right? Last weekend in March. So, anything else you want to tell us? Uh, just, we want everybody to come out. Uh, like I said, we try to make this very affordable for you. I know this is tough economic times, yeah. but, uh, you know, these filmmakers are, are worth it. These films are worth to pay, you know, five, yeah. ten dollars to see them. And uh, we really hope everyone comes out and has a great time, and then we'll do it again next year. Yeah. So, yeah, Gatlinburg Screen Fest in Gatlinburg, Tennessee, if you are out in the Smoky Mountain area of Tennessee or out in Gatlinburg, uh, during the last weekend in March, you should definitely come and check out these films. Jesse, thank you for coming. Thank you, Chuck. It's thank you for pleasure. telling us about Screen Fest. It's a pleasure to have you. Pleasure to have you as a friend. No doubt. And so, yeah, uh, until the next post, we'll see you later. Gatlinburg Screen Fest, check it out.